everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win, number 885, and I am still in Charleston of South Carolina. We have lots of people here, which is much appreciated. <laughs> this time, I am in downtown Charleston, South Carolina. I am at Bay Street Beer Garden as part of their Oktoberfest. I'm helping them kick off their brand new six pound kamikaze brat challenge. Now, this thing, it's gonna get weird, but it's gonna be a fun one. It's pretty much 100 ounces total, not including these beers, but that's 6.25 pounds. So the main parts of this, that is three and a half pounds of pork sausage bratwurst. It's about four inches in diameter or girth, and then it is 12 inches long, with this, there are 24 ounces or one and a half pounds of their pretzel bun that they specially made for this. This is gonna be awesome. But in addition to that, there is on top of this, there's their special sauce, but there is a Brussels sprout coleslaw. I've never had that before, so it's gonna be fun. Below this, there is a German macaroni and cheese there is horseradish, there's a spicy mustard, and then we've got some pickles here, but yeah, we've got all this, and then along the way, one of the sponsors of this, in Oktoberfest is, it's by Devil's Backbone Brewing Company. I'm gonna be having a full liter in these two pint steins. We've got their Munchen on Hops, which is a Bavarian IPA. So I've got 45 minutes to finish everything here. If I fail, it's gonna be $50. But if I win, I'll get my entire meal for free. I'll get a sweet t-shirt to add to my collection, and I'll be the very first person up on the Wall of Fame. Let's get this challenge started. <laughs> All right, big thank you to everybody here at Bay Street Beer Garden here in downtown Charleston, South Carolina for having me in to help kick off this challenge. We've got 45 minutes to do it. Let's shut up and eat. I don't really know my strategy. We'll just have to see what happens. But one, two, three, boom. All right. This pretzel bun is gonna be awesome. So let's just dig in. Don't worry, I won't eat it like this the whole way. The way they cook this is that they smoked it for five hours and it tastes like it, very flavorful, delicious, but let's just keep on chopping away at it. Gonna take some liquids to get all this meat down, but gonna try not to have too much. The mascot for Devil's Brewing Company in this beer is right behind me, so that beer is delicious. I had some before we started. His name is Munchin Man, kinda like me. <laughs> I'm really trying to be appropriate. And yes, this is my first time feasting on a 12 inch, four inch diameter sausage. Hey, do you guys have like a cheese sauce for this pretzel? If I can get some, that'd be awesome because you can't really eat this with the bun. All right, done with half of the sausage. Ah, 
going down. We're 10 minutes and 57 seconds in. We're making good time. We're 15 minutes and 15 seconds in. We got just under 30 minutes to go. Just gotta finish this last bit of the bratwurst and then we're on to the pretzel bun. So we're gonna get it. These last few bits of meat are going down real slow down the throat, but we are gonna get it and then we'll move on to the pretzels. Nineteen and a half minutes in, almost done with this, and I'm very, very excited. There's lots of seasonings in it, and it is delicious. Just harder to chew. It'll be more fun to finish off this pretzel. All right, last bite of the brock. I didn't really get to taste the Brussels sprout coleslaw by itself, uh, other than I think one bite, and I, I did really enjoy it. This German mac and cheese is delicious too, but now it's with the sauerkraut, the mustard, and everything else. We'll get it down and then do the buns. cheese to have along with it. It's uh, optional. I just asked for it. it was, I'm pretty excited about it. I think it's going to be a good idea, but we'll use that to help get all this pretzel down. We've got 24 ounces to go to get the victory. It's legit pretzel, not chewy, way different than other regular breads. Alright, right at 31 minutes in, we have 14 minutes to finish this and the beer. I did the bigger, uh, I did the bigger half first, so we should be okay. Oh, this pretzel is delicious, we're just getting full. minutes to go. We got we got time. I'm standing now. We're going to do it. Yeah. 45 minutes was a perfect time limit. Seven minutes to go. Remember, I'm a professional. I hope I don't regret saying that. Hey, uh, hurry. A Diet Coke no, uh, are with us. What's really happening is they wanted me to make this suspenseful, so this is for the, the restaurant. Oh, last bit of the food. Cheers in
It is the record because I'm the first to win, but definitely not uh, anything to call mom about. 44 minutes and 58 seconds was my finishing time. Big thank you to everybody with Devil's Backbone Brewing Company for help put on this Oktoberfest, which is uh, like a month long here at Bay Street Beer Garden in downtown Charleston, South Carolina. That was such a delicious six pound, 100 ounce, which is really 6.25 pounds. Their Kamikaze Bratwurst Challenge. Ooh, that was such a big three and a half pound uh, piece of meat, that bratwurst, and then that pretzel bun was delicious. Just so much food. So for finishing, I am going to get the $50 meal for free. I will get a sweet t-shirt, which is right here. We've got on the front, the Bay Street Beer Garden, and then uh, we got some text on the bottom, but I'm gonna be the first person up on the Wall of Fame, the record holder for being the first to win. But if you wanna try the challenge, let them know in advance so they can be ready. And even if you don't wanna try the challenge, this is my first time here. It is awesome. Not only is it massive and just beautiful on the inside, but they've got a really nice beer garden on the outside too, for you to enjoy when the weather is nice. So hope to be back in the future, but it was overall win number 885, just a few more to get up to 900. I will be in Greenville, South Carolina tomorrow, but it was a great time in Charleston. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah.